Good luck keeping up. He spoke a lot with Audi. He said, look, here's the ending we want to do with the Audi Q7, which is the SUV. Well, we have a family being lifted up in the Q7 by Ironmonger. Iron Man catches the Q7, and as he's lowering it down, the wheels spin and the car takes off. Action. But the whole sequence starts with it skidding to a halt. As Ironmonger's caught in the road, the family hits the brakes and the car skids. And that's how we had it storyboarded, pre viz the whole thing. I'm telling you, we could not get this car to skid because the anti-lock brakes. And we had it, we would wet the road down, we would spray the wheels with WD-40, anything we could do, all the movie tricks to get it to skid. They tried to disable, they spent two hours opening the hood and, and going through it and trying to snip wires and trying to turn off the anti-lock brakes so that they can get it to skid. You have to go to great lengths to bypass and trick things. They had to get blow torches and giant vices. You put more air in the tires, you put tire dressing down. We could not get the wheels to, to chirp to a halt. Then, when we wanted the wheels to spin out, when he lowers the wheels, we couldn't get that to happen either. Guess the traction control. So all of these things the stuntmen were trying to get this far to do, and the special effects guys were trying to get the Q7 to do, it wouldn't do. And a lot of these seasoned guys really thought they knew ways around it. Some of the best stunt guys in the business, some of the best effects guys in the business. Oh, yeah. Hey, look, this car's a little different, guys. The car was too tough, and it couldn't do what they wanted to do. They ended up putting electric motors to the wheels to try and get the wheels to turn. We had to go back, and I think we CGI'd that in because we couldn't get it to do it. So we found ourselves in a situation where we were trying to fight the engineering of these Audi engineers, and these cars were, were so well designed. And the joke was, might not be good for filming movies, but it's great for driving.